Hey guys, welcome to the 93rd C Sharp tutorial that I'm making for the new Boston. And in this tutorial, I'm going to be showing you how to use the list view control a little bit more. We're basically going to be removing items, and I'm also going to show you how to use uh, checkboxes along with the list view. So, uh, you're pretty much just going to need everything that we used in the previous tutorial. And the first thing that we're going to do is add another option to our context menu that says remove selected items. So now we're just going to double click on this so that it will create an event handler for when we click on this. Alright, and we're basically just going to copy this code right here because we can use the uh, remove method inside of the list view item class. So since there is a remove method inside of the list view item class, we can just do lvi.remove. And this, it just removes the item from its associated system.windows.forms.listViewControl. So basically, it will just remove this item from the list view. So it will go through every item that is selected, and then it will remove the selected items. So now we need to debug. We just uh, add a few items here. Alright, so now we just right click on it remove selected items, it'll remove one item or it can remove multiple items. You can also remove a whole bunch of items at once or every item inside of the list view at once. So in order to do that we're just going to use the clear method. So right here we're just going to go up and we're just type remove all items. Double click on this again. And there's a clear method inside of the uh, list view class. So we can just do list view one dot items dot clear. And this will basically just remove all of the items inside of this uh, items collection right here. So every item that is in the list view, it will just be removed or deleted. So now, no matter how many items we have inside of our list view, it will remove them all, even if we don't have them selected. So when we click this, it should remove them, even though we don't have any items selected. Yep. Now I'm going to show you how to uh, add checkboxes to your list view. And in order to do that, just go over to the properties panel and change checkboxes property to true. And basically this will just put a little checkbox right in front of your uh, list view item. So now when we uh, add some more items here, you can see the little checkbox right in front of the item. And we can check that, however nothing's going to happen right now. And we can use that as a check. So if we wanted to remove all of the checked items, we could do that as well. So I'll just add another button right here. Let's call it remove check items. This bar capitalized. Alright, so basically we can just go through every item inside of the list view and check to see if it's checked. And if it's checked, then we will remove it. So we're just gonna say for each uh, list view item, LVI in uh, list view, then we're just going to remove it. So, but first we have to check to see if it's checked or not. So we're going to say if it's checked. So if uh, the list view item is uh, checked, then we will remove it. So now, I'm going to debug here, just add a few items. We check this item, it should remove it. We check both these items, it should remove both of them. Yep. So that's pretty much it for this tutorial. So, see you guys.